Hey everyone, Ryan Salins here. Uh, sorry I haven't posted in a few weeks, but the webcam on my computer is broken, so I'm going to try to be crafty and use my phone. We'll see how it turns out. Uh, I had someone send me an email asking how do they refer to people such as pronoun and name when talking about them prior to their transition. So, you know, like for instance, I was Kim before, and so if someone's talking about growing up and hanging out with me as Kim, do, do they still use Kim or do they use Ryan and the male pronoun now? Uh, to give you a answer to that question would be kind of difficult because you really need to ask the individual what they're comfortable with. Uh, for me, I'd be comfortable if someone said, well, Kim did this. Um, I'm referring to a past memory that I was involved with, but that may not be the case for other people. Uh, especially when first transitioning, it may be really important to have people use their preferred name and pronoun even when referring to past things, because it just validates who they are and how they saw themselves before and how they want to be seen today. Um, so there's not really a clear-cut answer to that. Just like there's not a clear-cut answer to a lot of the different aspects of, you know, um, how you talk with a friend or talk about a friend who's transitioned because it's very individual preference oriented. Um, so I hope that what this little blog gives you is just uh, the uh, ability and permission just to ask. Right? Ask your friend what they prefer and what makes them comfortable. Um, and it will be better for both of you. Thanks. Bye.